origin on that one. And G2, they hesitated, but now they once again turn their attention there they inside. Built they built themselves the wall. Wall of Caitlyn Traps. Let's see if it buys them enough to make their team fights great again. 2,500, 1,800, 1,700. This is going to be a spike fight. Who's it going to go to? It's picked Ember. up by the Caitlyn. Ember grabs it. We've seen that one happen before, but on this side, it's a bit different. Now G2 need to beat the retreat. Can they get away? They've lost the trick, but do they lose this fight? Kick is slowed down. Can he get back to base? He's going to dash away, but stunned up by the Brom. Turns back in. Two members down, but G2 secure Baron. This one back as OQ picks him up, and now Zach Love is getting assassinated here. It's going to be a three for two in favor of Renegades. Mark is a Krubs posthumously feeling good about that one. A plus one team fight, and the siege continues. Yeah, I mean, that's why Krubs flashes. He was calling for the assistance of the rest of his team. Flares, what are you doing, buddy? He's walking into three people, gets stunned by Bard, dies for absolutely free. What a terrible mistake. He was four levels behind Freezing Seraph, and he body slammed in. Yeah, that is I don't know. never a play you want to make. That is... Very poor judgment by Flares at the back end of that fight. Makes it a 4 for 2, ensures that the turret goes down, and... To bounce that nicely, so Lolo is gonna have that, that set up for himself. I don't know if you bounce it, though. I, I think you push it. Oh, TP to the bot side so he can catch the wave? What is Lolo what? doing? What is he doing? That did not just happen. What is he doing? Arling Gale goes out. They're gonna see Rainover coming in, too. This is gonna be 4 for Getting on this. Rainover doesn't pick anything up, but Lolo oh TPs to the bot lane in error. And all last game, I was sitting there thinking, Lorlo looks like he has nerves. We've seen Matt adjust a little bit to the pressure. Dardock has seemed to adjust to it as well. In, the in these fights, for sure. And Piglet is definitely in hypercarry mode right now, but Darshan wants to kill him. <laughs> That's a little ambitious. Oh, the oh, double double TP! It's two of them, the double TP! He only thought it was one. He had to have only thought it was one TP, and he could exit that with a caliber net. It is nearly impossible to tell when two people are coming in on the same ward. You get to see the wow. It lights up for like a fraction of a second, and I do not know a person on this earth who can read that live. I no. think it is impossible. No, it does restart. I looked at it really <laughs> it closely. Does, it does closely, restart. But it's almost impossible to tell. I have the home guard bonus. They got even more moon speed for three seconds afterwards. In a crushing moment as well. After a really rough early game, we saw him come out of it early and he's been able to stay consistent as that Maokai. Hopefully he is what the team needs when they get Oh, turbates! What? Phoenix flexing his muscles there a yeah, little bit. Two completed I mean, items, and <laughs> and Turtle has the audacity to walk up to the, the three and one mid laner who just finished his second item, <laughs> and Phoenix says thank you. <laughs> and Turtle's sitting there going, he has the audacity to walk up to the three and oh, Lucian. <laughs> <laughs> My three kills versus your three yeah. kills. <laughs> we were just talking about Turtle before this game as well. You grasp the strengths. Oh. Match! Oh no! Oh, what? oh! That is not exactly how you want oh, to start it. Oh my god. And, and the three. discipline to give that kill yes. over to Huhi. Yes. Holy, that was a mind game and a half. So there was something. Yeah, he's on the opposite side of Piglet too. Right, so they were going to oh. come around and he would have the exit path already of and the jungler. He tried to panic flash so... Ryu has access to his TP. Gamsu does as well. They're locked down. Spirit, Spirit yeah. against the wall. Odo's got four members of Fnatic in front of him. The Glacial Fish has already been used, and Fnatic are trying to peel away. Yankos is in from the side. Collateral damage and the re-engage. Well, Gamsu's gone in. Ryu is dropping low. They've got the kill. Ryu is down. Fnatic are looking for more. They turn their attention onto Odo Omni as the Blade of the Rune King comes out. That's slowing Odo. One more Mystic shot. It's a kill. Reckless has taken him down. Gamsu is so... Beefy, left us by by time, and it throws Yankos to the borders. Feather picks up the kill, and H2K get aced. Five and zero. Look at the death timers. 40 seconds, and they're pushing in. This is a repeat of game two. Fnatic are looking for the inhibitor, and the crowd has exploded here in Rotterdam. Back to the game from Fnatic, and they are taking this inhibitor. His way towards this target. It's a lot of damage down. Keep oh, they got a here. They're able to get it, but the big kills. Crucible going to keep him alive. Five will go down. SMLZ. SMLZ is trying to spray. Ray Republic is going to try and knock him back into the team. Icon, he's still alive. SMLZ, he's kiting. He's still alive. He's going to he get him. it. He got triple. That's going to be the Penta for SMLZ. What a play coming from OMG. What a fantastic team fight for the lineup. You know, I don't even know if you can call it a play. He just sat still and they threw everything onto the Void Poppy. One more time he gets a Penta kill versus...
Which do we preference? We can't give them the fifth dragon. They could take the Baron if we give them that. Oh, Swiffer might be in trouble yet again. Choo Choo's explodes him. Tally might be in a bit of trouble, but more of Malmodius keeps him alive. Defend That's the, base. the pick. Yeah, they might need to go back there immediately as Tally is going to teleport. Or at least recall. There are no yeah. swipers They're trying. They're going to go back into the fight though. Carbon going to maybe catch him, but the first goal's going to pull him out. Does use it late as Regret goes in there looking for the Aussie. Swipers here though. Moves Egypt in for the Aussie and gets in on the card. Raider! Egypt. He's going to fall. But Raider! Threading through people. There's the dribble goal. There's the corner. He's going to go for the paint kill. kill. And he does get it. Raider goes off. That is everybody dead from Legacy. The Chiefs all the time in the world. And that's going to be lights out for Legacy. And what better way to finish it off as well as Radio picks up the Penta. <笑>你可以等下下去再下去嘛